Hello and welcome to today's video. So in this video I'm going to be dyeing my hair. So I've recently bleached the roots which are very yellow. They're actually more yellow than what it looks like they're showing up here. And then there's just so much colour stuck in my hair, like all of this blue is stuck from many, many times of bleaching. So I wanted to go pink and I've got a full top here of carnation pink by directions but it's a really really light pink I've used it before and it was just really pastel so I tested it here and you can see it's hardly shown up it's not looking pink it's looking more purple and it's hardly shown up so I've got a full top of this I've got half a bottle of pinky miso by crazy color and this is a very bright pink and then i've also got about three quarters of a bottle of fire by crazy color which is a very dark red and if i need it i've got orange as well but my thought is if i mix together this carnation pink with hot hot pink and fire it'll make over like a light red or dark pink color hopefully and hopefully it'll turn out decent on my hair so yeah that's the plan um so i'm going to mix these together and show you what color it ends up making okay so this is them unmixed so i'm just gonna mix them all together okay so this is the color it's turned out hopefully you can see that well enough um i am going to add some orange in just because i think it's going to end up being a nicer color um just like a bit more an orange tone to it as well so yeah okay so here is the color we've ended up with i think it looks quite cool i'm just gonna put it on my head okay i'm back hair dye top on gloves on hair dye ready to go basically i'm just gonna shove it all over my head as best as i can try and cover up as much as possible then i'll leave it on for around an hour and wash it out and i'll check back in in the morning with like the results so yeah i'm gonna pop this all over my head and that's the plan so let's time lapse The result um i've straightened this bit here really weird so let's just ignore that um but i really like it like i will just say that straight off but this is not what i expected at all from the colors that i mixed together so obviously like, what you can see in my roots here is like just how it's shown up so it's basically just the red has taken over all the other colors i put two pink dyes in there half a red dye and a bit three quarters of orange dye or something like that and the red's taken over like I feel like the red would probably be a bit brighter if I would have used it by itself but this is basically just red like there's not really much undertone to it and yeah um it's taken over the blue quite nice it is a lot darker where the blue was but I don't think it looks that bad um it's definitely passable it might not look like i've just done my hair like i don't think it looks like perfectly finished but you know hair fades so i think it's definitely passable um kind of wish i'd have really put some energy into bleaching these front bits and had these like the same light color as the rest of it but my hair's just really not in good enough condition to like try and do that now but yeah this is the result 
I'm really happy with it, really pleased with it. I left it on for one hour and then washed it out and then I just let it towel dry overnight and I've just kind of straightened it but I didn't want to put too much heat on it because we've got some fried ends. <laughs> so yeah. Um, yeah, this is what happens if you mix up those colours and put it on top of blue hair. Can't say I'm upset about it. It's quite quite cool. So yeah, um, do give the video a like if you liked it. Subscribe down below if you'd like to see more content like this. And you can always comment if there's like a colour you'd like me to try next. And yeah, see you next time. Bye.